Hello, everybody. Good morning. What a what an interesting sight you're having right now. Um, so today is today is Wednesday, and is eight forty five, and I thought I should I thought I should blog today because I am I'm gonna. I'm gonna spend my morning in Manhattan today. Uh, there's an exhibition that I really wanna check out um, at a gallery in Lower Manhattan. I don't know if it's in Lower Manhattan actually, uh, but now that I'm gonna be there, I'm gonna take my journal and journal a little bit. It's so weird talking to the camera without my glasses on. I feel like I'm naked. <laughs> There you go. God, my glasses are very dirty. Anyway, uh, I'm going to clean them. <laughs> so I'm going to Manhattan this morning and I'm going to take my journal because I'm trying to journal three times a week. So usually Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays or Saturdays. And I realized you guys that journaling three times a week is my sweet spot. I love journaling because I've said this a million times, but it's the only time that I have an active dialogue with myself. Because when you're thinking, thinking is, it can be an intentional thing, but most of the times it's an automatic thing, like you can control. Um, I mean, you can control it. Anyway, you know what I'm talking about. So journaling is the only time in which I can have like an active dialogue with myself and like think things or seeing patterns in behaviors or thoughts that I've been having. Um, I do also brainstorming when I'm thinking about like projects and stuff like that. And it's also the place in my life. I mean, it's not the place, but it's one place in which there are no judgments whatsoever. So I can say whatever I want. And it's a very refreshing, part of my creative and art practice. So usually I like to spice things up when I'm journaling and I will take my journal to the train or to the park or to the studio. Um, and so today I'm gonna take my journal with me and I wanna take you also to an art supply store that I haven't been in a while. And after that, we're gonna get to the studio because today I have to share my sketchbook tour with my patrons and i'm really excited because i just finished yet another ugly sketchbook which is the name i gave to my sketchbook uh, because again i needed a non-judgment place to draw to draw all of my ugly drawings uh, <laughs> and so i finished one i think this is my sixth or fifth ugly sketchbook um, and so I'm really excited to share the last couple of pages. Anyway, this is a very long intro, but welcome to this vlog. Um, the weather is really nice, so please grab my hand and let's go to Manhattan together. <laughs> Before we carry on, I wanted to thank Lingoda for working with me on this video. Lingoda is an online language school which offers 24-7 online classes by professional teachers so you can learn anywhere at any time. As you guys can tell by my sexy accents, I was born and raised in Chile, so Spanish is my first language, and I've been learning English most of my life. So in my experience, learning a new language is such a vulnerable process, especially speaking out loud for the first time. And I think this is the reason why I like Lingoda so much. They know the only way to learn a language fully is to be able to speak it. So you have a real time feedback from teachers who encourage you to speak since day one. Booking a class is mega easy. You can filter by time, dates of the week and number of classmates, for example, group or private, plus extra study materials for you to do in between classes. So right now the Lingoda team, you guys, went crazy because they're challenging all its users 
users for a two months challenge where if you complete a sprint, which are 15 classes a month, you get 50% of your money back. And if you complete the super sprint, which are 30 classes a month, you get 100% of your money back. I know it's insane. <laughs> Make sure to check the description for more info and use my code Fran Meneses for a sweet, sweet discount. Thank you so, so much, Lingora, for working with me on this video. Oh, one thing right here. Thank you.
Thank you.